Hello, welcome to Mama Says Kitchen. I'm going to share another dip with you today. Um, I'm practicing what we're going to have for graduation party, and this is one that is just one that we all love, and it's just a spinach dip. It's easy, and you start with a 10 ounce package of frozen chopped spinach. The hardest thing about it is you've got to squeeze every bit of the water out. I mean, you would squeeze it like you would a washcloth. So this is absolutely as dry as you can get it because I, I squeezed all the water out and then I made sure that it was completely dry. Then you're going to take a package of the Knorr vegetable mix. I'm going to take 16 ounces of sour cream. and one cup of mayonnaise. And Harold, if you would give me the cutting board over there with the uh, green onion. And just put it right there for me, thank you. Um, I took a bunch of green onions, which says a half of a cup I didn't measure it out because this was one bunch, and I'm thinking that is going to be almost perfect. My recipe says it's optional that you can use uh, a can of sliced almonds, but I never do. I just use this. So, I'm going to mix all of this together. And you do want to make this the day before to let all of these fl uh, flavors blend. But I make this a lot of times Christmas, you know, when we have Christmas parties or for um, a get-together. And I serve my spinach dip with... Um, Frito scoops, but this is just, just mix it together like that. And that's what the spinach dip looks like and it is absolutely delicious. Now, Harold doesn't care for spinach at all, but he loves the spinach dip. And I think it's just the flavors of the vegetable soup mix and the onions and, of course, the mayonnaise and the sour cream. And you've got your, your dip. But this is something that you can make if you're going to have parties or if you're going to just have a get-together and um, grill out or whatever. But like I said, our grandson Griffin is graduating and Amy's having a party. And I was just telling her different dips that she could have. And so I was going to go ahead and, and make it and uh, let her just see how much it would be. We'll probably double this recipe, though. But y'all, it's just something easy. Simple, simple as it can be, delicious, and I think you'll really like it. This is my shirt that I told y'all about. When you think that there's things that you just absolutely can't do, you're ready to throw your hands up and just quit and say, I can't do this anymore. But you know what? But I do. That's just to remind you that we do hard things. Miss Annie's shirt says, I can do hard things. And it's just something that people can say, what does that mean? And you could tell them. I would be telling them, I told Harold I couldn't do another chemo, but I do. 
Anyway, just want to remind you that Jesus loves you. Be salt and light wherever you go and let others see Jesus in you. I'll be back.